So we have seen shorthand if else, but there are some more points you need to remember when you are using shorthand if else. See, this is the example we have taken. Even and odd number we have to find out. So in shorthand if else we can write down this thing. First of all, if block statement, then if, then condition, then else, then else block statement. But you can use this shorthand if else if you have only one executable statement within this if and within this else only one. If this is the case, something like this. So I want two statement in this if block. So let's run this. A is six. So if you print even number and great these two statement. But if you want to write down this in terms of shorthand, then how you will write? First of all, you will write if if block statement. So there are two statements. So we write print even number print great. Then if then condition then else. But here it will give an error. Let's run this and I'll show you. See syntax error. This is invalid syntax. Only one statement you can print. Only one statement you can print here. It should be one statement. Then you can use shorthand if else to write down this case. So that's the next video. Till then, bye bye. Take care.